Good morning, friends. I'm gonna show you what we ate in a week for food. We're on a pantry challenge right now, and um, so we're not buying a lot of groceries at the store, just fresh produce, but we're not any worse for wear. I don't show you every single thing we ate. I don't show you, you know, the carrot sticks and apples and oranges that the kids ate for snacks, and I don't show you the homemade potato chips that Mary used to eat in the evening, or the pistachios that he snacked on, or the ice cream I ate after dinner. I don't show you everything, I just show you most of it. So, hope you enjoy our weekend food. So today in food, we have ice cream doing its thing. We've got a potato, broccoli, sausage soup that I'm gonna add milk and cheese to. Um, we've got crackers in the oven. There's a few trays, just doing some food prep today. I just made a bunch of, <laughs> I just made multiple jars of dulce de leche. So the kids are eating themselves some caramel and dulce de leche. Mama, Mama, are we still eating the same cream? Are we still eating Some apples and dulce, maybe later for you. Apples and caramel. Um, a wheel of cheese going on here. What did you guys have for breakfast? I can't even remember. Odds and ends. We just kind of ate odds and ends that needed to be eaten. I had some leftover smoothie that I had in the fridge from yesterday. We had peanut butter cookies. You had peanut butter cookies. And we'll have bread with dinner tonight as well. And it's Saturday right now. So for breakfast we had fruit, kale, avocado, smoothies, milk, yogurt, that sort of thing, along with buns. We're having cheese. And so what are we having for lunch now? Carrots, carrots apples, apples, dulce de leche, cheese. There you go. This is, we're having a nice snack platter for lunch today. Where's Hank? Good question. You should, oh, well, he went upstairs. So we have a package of tortillas from the cupboard. Mac is making quesadillas with mozzarella I made. This is lunch. Breakfast was oatmeal and applesauce, and I had leftover smoothie. I'm also in the process of making feta. And we're also in the process of getting a basket ready for town. Hamish is clearing the table. We are going to bring the tortillas to go with us. The quesadillas, I should say. Rowan is feeding herself there. Um, and then thawing here, I have some beef dip the meat and au jus. We're gonna have that with the rest of the buns or bread for dinner. That is Tuesday in food. So we're just cleaning up now, but we had our homeschool group here and we had hot dogs and marshmallows. That was our lunch. For breakfast, S'more. we had s'mores. What did we have for breakfast? Um, sandwiches. sandwiches, I had a smoothie. Um, dinner, I'm just getting ready to photograph dinner here. We're having spout, this is a recipe. It's on my blog. It's got well, rabbit, potatoes, carrots, and these are pork hocks, and it just that's baked in the eat. oven for a few hours. And um, that's Wednesday in food. Did we even eat any snacks today? I don't yeah. think so, we had breakfast and then we didn't eat anything till lunch. Mm, yeah. And I've got feta on the go there. So this is not the most exciting breakfast, but I just made a big smoothie. It was dripping a bit, so I put it on a dirty plate. And this is my breakfast for this morning and the next two mornings. Just makes things easier, make sure I get enough greens, fats, fruits to start my day. Um, the kids had smoothies as well as tea and cinnamon twists. We're getting ready to go pick up my mom and stepdad from the plane in a bit. Um, it's 8 o'clock in the morning. <laughs> it's 8 o'clock. Just wait a second, pray. I didn't show you any food yesterday. We had a chaotic day yesterday. Couldn't even tell you what I had for breakfast or what my children had for breakfast. Couldn't tell if... I don't know if I had breakfast right away. I might have not ate till later. It's what happens when I run out of smoothie. Smoothie just means I get a decent breakfast. I made cinnamon twists and we went to an event yesterday. Like a 
discussion on feed analysis and ruminant health and it was really great. I made cinnamon twists, so I think that's what we ate for lunch. We had cinnamon twists and whatever treats were there and coffee and tea. It went really late, so we got home at almost two o'clock. Hold tight a second. We had fruit for snacks, we had leftovers for dinner, nothing very exciting in food yesterday. I have a pot roast, beef pot roast out to throw in the oven when we get home from town, as well as I'm gonna make a roasted vegetable plant-based curry. My mom eats plant-based, <laughs> AKA vegan, so, that's what the next few days are gonna look like, kind of doing double duty, but if I make a big batch of this curry, she'll eat that if the next night isn't plant-based. She's totally cool to just eat leftovers and whatever. She's very easy to please, but I find kind of making a big batch of something the first day she's here makes things a lot easier. She's also happy to cook her own food and all that. She's a very easy house guest, and my stepdad eats anything and everything and loves it all. Um, so, I'll show you those later. The curry's on my blog. It's delicious, even if you don't eat vegan. I love it. Okay, what are you gonna say? Me and Grandpa are coming here. Are you so excited? Yeah. Me and Grandpa are coming here. Mm -hmm. Me and Grandpa. And the other thing that I haven't shown you guys yet is every other day I make formula for Rowan. That's extra formula because I didn't have enough bottles. But I make a double batch, it lasts two days, put it in bottles. This bottom shelf in our fridge is always that. It's usually the evening when I'm making it for some reason. Are you ready for a nap? Do you need a bottle? Is that what you're after? Yeah? Okay, let's put you down for a nap. Here we have a massive pot of what we call plant-based curry. It's roasted vegetables, all from the garden, in a coconut milk curry. That's right, and raw. Beef roast, uh, there's two big ones in there, lots of leftovers. And then broiled potatoes. And Rowan is loving it. So this morning we had a frittata for breakfast. For lunch we had bear hot dogs. Um, there was popcorn, I can't remember what else was involved today. For dinner today we have baked potatoes, salad, and beef steaks. Hot baked potatoes. Scalding hot. 